Hey, what's happening boys and girls? Thanks for stopping back into the channel today right here with a Rust Belt Mechanic. So today I've got one kind of a weird dilemma. Since I had quit the dealership, I had to move all of my tools. As you guys can see, you got the toolbox and everything. I had to move all of my tools, box and everything back here into my shop here at home. Well, I've still been working with doing more tools and working with a couple more companies and my tools keep on coming in, but I have no more room for them. I have doubles and I have triples of some things that I really don't really need that much anymore. Now you're just showing off. So I've got the dilemma where I need to get rid of them in some way, in the best way possible, passing them down to the next generation of automotive student. <laughs> So if you guys don't already know, here on the channel, I have been a huge proponent for being able to give students who are getting into the automotive career or generally the hands-on careers, HVAC, technologies, or something like that, the best leg up that they possibly can get. They've got a hard thing going for them where they have to go to school, they have to purchase tons and tons of tools that they really can't afford right off the bat, and it's scaring a lot of technicians away from getting into these amazing fields. So today with all the extra tools that I have, we're gonna go through those today, and I'm gonna be taking them to a local CTC school here in Pequot, Ohio, uh, where we're gonna be talking to the main instructor there on what their plans are gonna be for these tools that I'm gonna keep on bringing them. If you guys don't remember, back in the day, myself and JRC54 ran the company called Toolheads Crate. You guys can actually see one of our old boxes sitting there in the background. Well, we ended up getting rid of the company and somebody else runs it now. So Toolheads Crate is still running. Right now it is veteran owned right here in the United States and they're doing a really great job. They offer like three different lines of tool packages that you can select from each month. So it's a really great thing that they're doing right now. So kind of partnering up with them. They're, they've been sending me their uh, top tier crate each month so we're seeing some of their top tier crates right here from toolheads crate uh, we can see in this one we've got i think that was in here we had a bunch of toolbox widgets some really nice half inch sockets an impact driver set some pliers a whole bunch of socket extensions and stuff in there really great in there uh, we've got some cleaning things a bunch of different pliers and screwdrivers lights random stuff inside of their headlamps, really great stuff within there. On top of that, I've been doing some looking and purchased uh, some used tools and some different stuff off of uh, a guy who sold Imperial Tools, which they do some really great snap ring pliers and different pliers. So I picked up some of those stuff from them as well. You got some different interchangeable tip pliers. All in all, we've just got three really big boxes, two of them from Toolheads Crate right here. Uh, we're going to be donating over to the school and then one from Imperial Tools as well. So big shout out to those companies, especially to Toolheads Crate for being able to get involved with this one. I will leave the link down in the description below for you guys to check out the Toolheads Crate monthly subscription service. So here we are in with the CTC school here in Pickle, Ohio. I've got Mr. Andy Bueller, who's the head of the automotive department. And these are all the tools that you guys are seeing right here that, to be able to donate to them. Uh, thanks to Toolbox Widget, thanks to Imperial for all their donations and everything for the channel and all of this. Uh, Mr. Bueller, why don't you give us a thing on what you guys are going to be using this for? So these tools that Kyle's provided us, uh, we're going to be using them for like perfect attendance, drawing, so my students in the junior and senior program, uh, they have perfect attendance for the nine weeks. They'll be in the drawing form. Try also do it for student of the week, student of the month. Oh wow! And then if we do our uh, Skills USA program this year, maybe some of those will be in for the first, second, and third place uh, contestants. Well, that sounds really cool. Now you also have to realize that you know the toolbox widget stuff or in the um, the toolheads crate right here from Toolheads Crate, uh, they're coming to be coming like every month. 
Okay. So this isn't going to be all of them. So we we'll got more stuff coming. We'll have more stuff okay. coming that I can't. I, I don't have room for it in my house in my garage. So why not forward it on to the students who really need a start off in their education on the automotive world? Because we all know that the automotive world, you have to buy your own tools here in the United States. And that's one of the hardest things getting into the program. And that's one of the hardest things for a lot of younger students who really aren't off on their own yet. And they're not able to buy thousands of dollars worth of tools right off the bat just to get their career started. So this is a step in the right direction for them. I think it's going to be a big help for them. I mean, you think this will be at least oh, yeah. some good start this for them? Great incentive for them to make sure they're showing up and doing well. Oh, yeah, little, incentives. Little so incentives, that's another thing that we were talking about that these students, yes, they're in high school still, but this is a great way for them to start off their career in wanting to do better in school because who doesn't like getting tools? I have to say, if I was going to be getting free tools, I probably would have done a little bit better in high school myself. More free stuff, more free stuff, more free stuff. More uh, free all stuff, I have are these spec sheets. Free stuff, more free stuff. So that's going to be a nice incentive for these kids. So it's really great to be able to see these things going to a really good cause here at the Upper Valley Career Center in Piqua, Ohio. So big shout out to these guys because they're putting on a great program for a lot of students. I'll get some B-roll here so you guys can kind of see what's going on and what kind of a shop they've got going on here. It's really impressive. It is for such a small town school. I, I absolutely love it and that's why I'm going to continue to uh, donate to the program and to this school and you guys are going to see a lot of that coming up from here on out. So just another thing to be able to point out for you guys who maybe are in the automotive career or if you are just getting out of it what's the good of a lot of these tools that might just be sitting around why not donate them to some local CTC schools to be able to get these students started off in their own automotive career so thank you Andy I really appreciate being thank able to come you. in thank today you, Kyle. not a problem let's go check out these things <laughs> It's a party mode, it's gonna flow till it can't no more. I got the party in the back, business is attached. Tell you what, now that is one really, really good group of kids. I'm beyond excited that I was able to be able to give something to them, something to help incentivize them towards getting started in their careers and, you know, getting the foot off on the right path in their careers early on while they go to school. If they're getting good grades, they're getting really excited about the programs, it's gonna start off a better career for them. And I'm really looking forward to seeing what the Upper Valley JVS and the CTC there has to be able to put out for local businesses here over the next couple of years. There's some really smart students in that class. Hopefully you guys are able to see that in yourselves. And for the guys who are going to schools there, keep it up. Make sure you keep up on your grades. And remember, kids, if you want to be cool, stay in school. Always be training. Always be looking forward into the future. Things are going to be going your way here real soon. Now, for you other guys who have a bunch of these extra tools and stuff sitting around, this might just go to show you where you guys can put all of those extra tools. Uh, say I've got the two or three toolboxes worth of stuff that I might have triples of. You might just find it seeing a better home in a student's hands, being able to start off their career on the right path. I think them getting hold of some new tools and stuff, getting them uh, started off in the right way is pretty much the best way to be able to give to those programs. So you guys have those extra things, be thinking about that one. Maybe look forward to that in your area. Well guys, that's about all I've got for you today in the way of content here. I've got a lot more stuff coming up here in the next couple of weeks. We've got the Project Crappy 300 coming up and I have got a massive laundry list of parts coming along for it. First off, we took the wheels off of it and we're gonna be totally refinishing those with none other than Raptor USA products. So 
We got some Raptor lining coming for some of these specialty wheels, and we're gonna have a good time with this one. It's gonna be a really crazy fun build. So make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel. If you haven't already, make sure you turn on that bell notification so you get notified when I come out with cool, awesome content, just like this one here today. I appreciate it, and as always, you guys stay awesome. Oh, that special effects though. The Chrysler 300C. Do 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 do